This is the Spring Boutique, the first one that we've ever done, and the ben it's a, an artisan's fair. Um, all kinds of different vendors, food vendors, um, home items, all kinds of different vendors, as well as different high school organizations, different sports teams, and groups selling some of their merchandise. Get it in prior to Mother's Day, so it's kind of marketed towards that, Mother's Day gifts and weddings and that type of thing. Well, Lisa Laverie, who's the coordinator of the event, does the holiday fair every year and it's really very successful. And this year the high school team is in desperate need of new boats. They're trying to replace their very old fleet. So she suggested, why don't we try a spring fair and have the uh, portion of the proceeds benefit the team. So that's how this was born. My son is the captain of the high school sailing team and when your kid is captain, you are the booster parent. So. Uh, um, she, Lisa also has a child on the team and it was her idea to um, create this event to help benefit the team this year. Um, there's probably about 50 different vendors here. Um, some are handmade items, some are small boutiques and shops. And this year the benefits are going to the Kids Pan Mass Challenge and the Hingham High School Sailing Team. We're one of the benefactors of the Spring Day Boutique which we're really excited about. Some of the proceeds will go to the Kids Ride, which goes to the Jimmy Fund at the Dana-Farber Cancer Institute. So we're really uh, pleased that Lisa Laveri, who is coordinating this whole event, has chosen us as, as one of um, her donors to give to. Well, I think this is a great event for us to kick off and make people more aware that the PMC Kids Ride is coming up. And to get ready to register. We hope to have over 400 riders this year and we hope to raise about $75,000. I think it impacts the community as a whole because you know we're out there trying to get the children uh, be thinking about being philanthropic and thinking about their bigger world than just Hingham and by going out and riding for people that they love who they might know have cancer or had had cancer um, and just making them aware and while they're um, doing a good deed they're also getting physically fit too which is really important. You can register online at www.kidspmc.org slash Hingham um, well, Lisa has a pretty good group of vendors from doing this over the years, so she reaches out to her vendors um, in preparation for an event like this to get their confirmation, and then reaches out to any new vendors that she hears about in town, any new artisans um, out there who are trying to get their products marketed, she reaches out to them, and it's an opportunity to have uh, local people viewing their products and buying their products. So, And then she reaches out always to all the high school groups, so they have an opportunity to sell merchandise to fundraise for their various organizations. Comics it. Um, I've gotten good feedback as far as the quality of items that are here and um, things that are a little different if they're looking for things that are a little different than just going to a store and buying something so because they do have this um, in the fall that people in town know that what quality of uh, vendors that are here and um, they kind of know what to expect so hopefully we'll get a good turnout today. I think people will have a great day of shopping for their mothers for Mother's Day and um, if they can stop by um, and just get introduced to the kids ride if I can introduce somebody new to the kids ride that will be great today and if I can get somebody to register or volunteer even better they get some free PMC gear um, to encourage them and um, I would just love to get the word out more. It's really a great opportunity for community members to come down here and, and support their local students. So many of the high school kids are here selling their things, so um, many of the parents or those involved come on down. It's really become more a social event as well as a fundraiser. Well, I hope they'll come out and support our local vendors who are um, trying to put their products, as well as all our students who are trying to raise money for their organizations, and of course, and especially the sailing team. Um, to, to participate in an event like this, the holiday fair, or if we do the spring fair again next year, they would contact Lisa Smith and um, you could contact her through the high school office, the, um, the Hingham High School office. They can put you in touch with her. Uh, as far as getting in touch with the sailing team, if you want to make a contribution to help us with these boats, um, our athletic director Margaret Connedy would be happy to field any questions you might have in that area.